Why, hello there! Welcome back to my Let's Play, guys. My name is Moss517, and I'm in the loading screen for Woodbury. And the reason for that is, is two reasons, actually. For one, I have a lot of people sometimes be like, Hey, I think he has it on creative mode secretly, and he just puts it on survival when he records. That is not true. The reason for that is, created in survival mode, owned, lawyered, whatever, whatever word we're going with. You guys were wrong. But no, everyone's entitled to their opinion if they thought that, and a lot of people probably had a lot of reason to believe that, but... You were wrong, and I am right. And uh, another reason is, is because I grinded out a ton off camera. Like, I got freaking 21 ender pearls, which is not a lot, but I do not have a farm, like an, a legit ender pearl farm. So, for me just to run around and hunt off camera, I think that was a, you know, pretty, a pretty good, uh, a pretty good haul. Let's call it that. But yeah, I just wanted to kind of show you guys that because I knew if I had it and then you guys were like, oh, 16 ender pearls, oh, this, this hacker, this, this cheater. Yeah, because I want this to be strictly survival. I've had people be like, Modest, we're your subscribers. We give you permission to put it on creative to spawn an end portal or to give yourself villagers. Trust me, I would love to have an end portal. Try to make some sort of ender pearl farm or just go there and fight endermen just to get it since they're probably just constantly going to spawn there anyways. You know, I would... I would love to do that, but it's an in or it's an inconvenience for me not be or not being able to, and I'm okay with that because I'll just you know I'll wait until I have to start a new world. Like if they add like jungle biomes or whatever that gets added that I have to have a new world to get, and it's like something I really want, then I'll start a new world. And I've made a lot of progress in this world in how many episodes? Like I wouldn't say a ton. I tend to adventure a lot rather than build, and I really want to get back into building more. But you know, if I had to start a new world, I would just be like freaking let's play season two let's do this and like i would freaking you know I would do it in a heartbeat i would you know i wouldn't care to be a new map new stuff like that just it'd, it'd overall be fun but yeah so now that that's all out of the way what my plan for this episode is, is i want to build a house i want to build a house from the last things to build episode which was uh on saturday today's sunday for me because i'm recording this but you guys won't see it till monday so the house you guys saw two days ago and i just think this house is really cool it's just a very simple house i would use it if say i did like a hardcore playthrough i would build that house i would be like yo this is gonna be my little house if i wanted storage i'd make like a basement to it just put like a trap door and have some storage down there all that good stuff but i think in this world since i got like my freaking mansion right there this, this house will just go get his little scenery house. And I think I'm going to add another one over here. I'll probably do that off camera at some point or something like that. But yeah, that's my plan for this episode. And before I actually do that, I'm actually going to kill these cows. Because I've I've put these guys through, what, like two, two breeding sessions so far, if that's what we're going to call it. And it's just crazy. There's too many of them, so they need to die. And I need, I need a good source of food. I need my protein because I've been freaking living off watermelon. It's ridiculous. Watermelon heals you, not heals you, uh, replenish like one hunger bar. And steak replenishes four, and it's just, ah, it's bad. Alright, so we're gonna bust out the looting sword here, which is the freaking greatest sword ever. And let's actually grab two wheat here, because we're gonna need to, we're just gonna leave two of them alive. We're gonna make these guys pretty much extinct. Man, I keep, uh, I keep trying to breed these pigs, and I don't see any other pigs. I wonder if, like, the pigs can't even reach each other when I try breeding them. I don't even know. I don't know what the case is. I'm just gonna kill the pigs and keep this strictly a, uh, a uh, steak farm or a cow farm, whatever we're gonna call it. And I'm at least aiming to get a full stack from these guys, which I think I'm definitely gonna get. I seem to be like triggering the the looting part a lot. I'm just getting a lot of steak from these guys. So I'm hoping for a full stack, because a full stack will last me a while. And before I didn't really keep up with the breeding. I think I'm gonna make that like a routine thing now. It's like anytime I freaking see the cows like freaking full grown, then I'll just breed again and again, and I'll just maintain it. It'll be fancy. It'll be all nice. Oh, that guy didn't even give me one, really. Alright, kill you. Kill you. And then two of you guys. How much do we get? 64 plus 13 equals what math? 77. Alright, not bad. Oh, I just threw that away. Hope my math is correct. Anytime you're recording yourself and you have to do like math or spell something correctly, your mind just screws with you. It's pretty much like, yeah, that that is the correct way. Or the, uh, the correct answer or like correct math, whatever the scenario may be. But you were just going to think to yourself, holy crap, it's not right. Because you just think, holy crap, a lot of people are going to see this. And, and you do not want to be wrong. And your, mo or your mind just makes you all paranoid. It, is, it just sucks. It is so unfortunate. But oh well. Alright, so I'm just going to replant this real quick and we will get started with the house. But yeah, I just, I really want to get more building done on this world, just in general, because I want this to be a freaking town, not just this little 
intersection thing. I want to add cool stuff. So like I freaking cleared out a bunch of stuff here and I like I'm going to build that and I'm going to build another one and it's just it's going to be sick. I have so many so many plans for this world. It's just going to be wonderful. But I'm just going to go put these uh these stakes in the furnace real quick and then I will get started in the house. Which I got I got other house designs in mind that I really want to do. I want to do some sort of boat house. I don't know why. I think that'd be so sick like, you know, some house in the water. It's like I don't know. I don't know really how to uh, how to describe it. Pretty much, it's just a house or like a boat that you would live in, but it's in the interior. It's shaped like a house. I, I don't know how to describe it. I really don't. My mind is a uh, my mind's going crazy right now with uh, what I'm trying to say. But whatever, whatever. I'll freaking I'll end up building it at some point. And then you guys will see what my mind was thinking. It'll be good. Put this apple in there. Uh, I don't even need this golden apple. Screw that. Dirt, whatever. Uh, Alright, that should be good. Wait, are these pork chops almost done? No, 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 I'll let them cook. Alright, and uh, one thing I want to do too is I'm almost to level 30. I was actually grinding out using my uh, my mob farm last episode, or not last episode, uh, while off camera. And I got kind of bored, that's why I didn't finish and get to level 30. But once I do, I think I'm going to enchant another bow. Because I did a sword last, and I know I did a bow before that, but I just want to get an infinity bow. Because when I was sitting there trying to grind out... And I uh, get the ender pearls while I was sitting there waiting for them to spawn. I was just shooting mobs with my, uh, you know, with my bow, which my bow is good. It does a lot of damage, but I had like a full stack of arrows and I only have 18. Like, you know, that's my own fault because I was bored and I was just like, oh, let's do some target practice. But I don't know. I think an infinity one would just be nice. It's rare to get, but you know, I'm freaking. Oh, true. What are you doing? I am willing to try to get that because I think that'd be fun to get. Not to mention, I don't really have anywhere else I or any other stuff I really need to enchant like. My armor is about to break, my helmet and my uh, my boots are probably going to break before my legs and my chest plate. But the way I'm going to do it is, if my helmet breaks, I'm just going to put an iron helmet on and enchant it. And then once most of the armor is pretty much on the verge of breaking, that's when I'll make a new full set of armor. Because I want to make the armor all at the same time, not be like, oh the helmet broke, let me build that. And then by the time my chest plate's about to break that, the diamond helmet will be like halfway broken, if you guys understand what I mean. So I'm just going to make like an iron helmet, I'll put like one level of enchantment, try to get like protection one on it, and just, you know, have a decent set, and then next, uh, once all the armor's almost broken, I will make a full set of diamond armor, and I'll do what I did last time, I'll just sit off camera and just grind out level 30 each time, which takes forever, it is not enjoyable whatsoever to sit and get 30 levels four times in a row. So, what, 120 levels in a row? It's it's not pleasant whatsoever to do. But, you know, it's worth doing to actually get some good enchantments. And I think that's what I'll end up having to do. So, I kind of, I'm dreading when that happens. But, you know what? Oh, well. What are you going to do? But, I don't have the the leaves that go with this. The leaves of these ones, which these add more color. But, I think that the leaves, like these say oak leaves. They say oak leaves, but they're, they're spruce leaves pretty much. Or that, they are uh, that color. And so, I think I'm just going to put these on because I think they might look better, honestly. I just went with oak leaves because I thought they looked good, but who knows? These ones may look better. Oh, these look way better. It gives it a lot more of a uh, a darkened feel. Not like dark as in like, ah, oh, like freaking, oh, I'm trying to think, like, like dark in a, not dark in a bad way, like dark in a, uh, dark in a good way. Let's just say that. I don't even know how to de describe it. I don't know, I just like that. I think it looks good. Like, this would be like, if you lived in a snow biome, this would what be what the house looked like. Like, pretty much just imagine like this, and then on top of on top of the leaves, we have snow. Ah, oh, I can imagine it, and I think it would look fancy. Alright, next we need to make... Oh, I think it's made too many. I need eight of these. Go like that. And then go like this. There we go. Next, we need some wood planks. Or oak wood planks, actually. I hate when I have to say wood planks and then I have to like specify which type of wood. Ah, it's just a pain. It's boring. I actually need to remove these ender pearls. I'm accidentally gonna scroll one one too far and I'm gonna press the left trigger to place it. And I'm in, or I'm gonna end up Oh, why am I taking these off my hopper? What am I thinking? I'm gonna end up freaking accidentally placing the uh or I'm gonna accidentally throw an ender pearl. And it's just gonna suck. Alright, so that's for the uh that's for the doorway because obviously the floor is gonna be oak. And then this is for the pathway. There we go. Alright, now we need to make a bunch of these. I'm going to make a full stack of these because if I have any left over, I'll just use it to make slabs because I'm going to need more slabs for the roof. Build too high each time. I like this house though. Even in survival mode, you can build it relatively quick if you have the supplies. Like I prepared off camera. I made sure I had a bunch of, uh, I had a bunch of wood for it or whatever. 
But overall, not a hard house to build. I like it. The only bad thing is that it's getting nighttime soon, so I'm actually going to add a couple torches so I can see what I'm doing. I'm confident that no mobs are going to show up because they, they never do. They're scared of me. They, they know what I'm capable of. Go like this. I hope I did my measurements right. This does not look right. But that's just me being paranoid, I think. I think I did. Or at least I hope I did. If not, I'm pretty sure it'll be fine. But, oh well. What are you going to do? Uh, do I not have enough wood? Ooh, I may not have enough oak wood. I hope I do. That should be enough. I think all I need to do is fill in the rest of the wall and the floor. Which, ah, I just realized I may not have enough for the floor. But I have, a like, I think few more logs in the house that I could grab so hopefully those will be or those will work at like that yeah I think I think this is uh the proper size I think I was just being very paranoid flower what are you doing here uh, let's put that there uh oh I think I may have done it wrong actually did I I'm I'm very oh no I think I did it right I think I did Oh yeah, I totally did it right. I'm just, I'm being, or did I not? Oh no, guys. Oh my god, I, I think I did the measurements backwards. I think this was supposed to be, it was, the back wall is supposed to be three, and then it's supposed to be two on the windows, and I think I actually, oh no, I think I did it wrong. Uh-oh. Can I fix this easily? See, this is what happens when you try to wing something. I may know the measurements because I took the time in creative mode, but when it actually comes to recording it, did not do the proper measurements, I don't think. Huh. I don't think that's a big deal, though. Not really. Yeah, that's not a big deal. Not at all. Whatever. I'm not freaking out over it. Alright, let's go get the rest of the wood, fill in the floor, and then we can do the roof. I'm actually going to sleep real quick. That way I don't have to worry about any mobs. Got the pork chops out of there. I could actually probably enchant a bow by, uh... You know, during this episode. It may not be the most entertaining thing to watch me grind out some uh, mobs, but I really would like to enchant the bow. And I like doing it on camera, because you know, I don't want to have to wait and be like, alright, now I have to wait until I'm recording again to do it, and I didn't even grab the wood. Look at me getting sidetracked like a derp. Alright, we got any wood in here? We got nine, any wood in here? We got slabs, but I don't want to use slabs for a floor. That just bugs me. And they might be the old slabs that you have to delete with a pickaxe, because someone was like, why is he using an axe on that? So I'm pretty sure I explained why. Ah, uh, yeah. It looks fine, though. I, it's just, it's bugging me because I know I did it wrong, but I think it's fine, though. Oh, whoa, whoa, Enderman. Whoa, I didn't know you came around my area. Hey, you want to meet my loading, or my looting sword? Want to say what up? Bam! Oh, into the water. Oh, that was like 300 style. Too bad I wasn't dressed as a Spartan. Enderman, there you are. Oh, oh, you're going on my roof now. You want to say hello to my bow? Boom, always oh, on fire now. This guy is going down. And show me the money. Oh, see? See, that's what I mean. That's what I have to deal with on an occasion. It's just just no ender pearls from this whatsoever. It's just horrible. Alright, let's actually that should be enough. 21. I'm just gonna have to model the interior a bit different now. And I'll have to do the uh the windows a bit different also. So it'll be three on this side. And then three on this side. And two in the back. I actually like that better, I think. I really do. I think it I think it makes the house look better. Whoa. Why are these deleted? What happened here? Oh, I must have deleted through the window and I accidentally hit them. Hmm. Oh well. Alright, next we need what do we need? I think I actually brought the stuff I need for the interior. I brought some of it. Actually I don't think I brought any of it. What was I thinking? Bring an item frame. Is there anywhere that's, uh... Ah, oh, this torch is kind of in the way. But, we can find a new spot. I want to put a clock here, that's why. Alright, let's do that. I think I'm actually... Oh, I just got a, got a good idea on how to furnish this bad boy. Back into the house we go. We gotta go get some supplies. Supplies, here we come. Here we go, we gotta get some bookcases. Which I don't even think I have any bookcases, do I? I do not. Uh oh, that's not good. I don't need them. I just had a uh, an idea on something I could do. Are right, we got that? Um, I don't know if I grabbed wool and put it in the chest because I need to make a bed. 
I have a lot of white wool. I need to freaking use it, make something cool with it. Grab that. Um, oh, is the steak done? I'm very eager. I want to freaking want to eat the steak. Eat it all. Oh, that was where the pork chops were. Steak, you done? Oh, that's almost done. Um, all right, so we got 15 there. Full stack there. We'll let the rest cook. Put this back in there. Nice. We got a good old, good stockpile. 64 steak. All legit. You guys saw it. Not even in creative mode. I'm a level 25 yet. Shouldn't take too long to get to level 30, I don't think. Alright, so let's place our crafting table down. We'll put it... We'll put the crafting table here. We'll put the furnace in the corner. We're going to make two beds. Other bed goes right there. And let's make two chests. So we have like a nightstand on each side. And then we'll put a furnace there. And then we'll be good. That'll just be, you know, a simple house. Simple and nice. And of course, I don't have any cobblestone on my, or any cobblestone on me. I never do. Do I have the windows in here? No, I do not. I, I talk about how I'm all prepared and I didn't even grab what I need. I need four fence posts, a bunch of slabs, and some windows. So 24 should be enough. What else do I need? A furnace, which I have one in here. Bam. I can actually, you know what? I'm not even using this coal. It's just taking up space. I'll just put a stack of 64 coal in it. This will pretty much be like these houses that people can stay in if they ever visit my world. So like if Waffle comes in or if New Blue does, you know, there's a simple house over here that someone can just live in. Simple and fancy. Da -da -do. Place that there. Like that. There we go. Bam. Bada boom bam. Bada boom -ba bam. See, I do like this house to live in. Like, to, to constantly build and be like, you know, the only one building, I need a lot of storage. But just this house is so cozy. I don't know. I love it. It's so nice. All right. Next thing we need is we need a bunch of spruce slabs, which I should have in here. 42 are enough. All right, we need to add like that. Then we need to add like this. Then like like that. We need to actually remove this tree. Tree, get out of here. Actually, let's chop the, the wood from it. Have some wood to use, and so this all despawns and get get it off the house at least and there we go and put three on this side nice 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 now we're gonna need some trap doors four is not gonna be enough I don't think let's put one on this side because we're gonna put a torch here which actually I don't think we're gonna put a torch there oh oh that's I guess that's how you get a trap door off Right, let's put that back there. Let's put this here. Uh, I really want the trap door on this side, so we're just gonna have to find a spot to put a torch, which we can probably put one there. Or even leave these here because the fence posts have to go on this block right here. Um let's keep placing these. So we'll put one here. See, these don't really make sense because the trap door is meant to cover this window, and then it's like if you put one, you know, you have one here and then one here, what about the middle window? So, I don't know, I just think it adds a little bit of detail. As long as you're not picky like me that, you know, like I notice things like that, you guys may not, then uh, it shouldn't matter to you guys. You guys should be fine. Alright. Oh, that should be enough. I, I made way too many. And then, see, I like this pathway. If you wanted to add, like, a garden back here, you could, but, you know, that, since I'm not living in this house, that's not, or, or that's nothing I have to do. Or you could have, like, a little pond behind it and put, like, some sugar cane or whatever. It'd be great. It'd be wonderful. Alright, we got all that good. So most of the house is actually done here. All we gotta do now is slab it up. So let's just pull a bunch of this stuff back. Clear out our inventory a little bit. So we got way too much stuff in here. Item frame. Do -do -do. Need these slabs. Ah, uh, we actually need... Let's just make all these into wood planks and make all these into sticks. Don't need a crazy amount of uh, fences, but we'll just we'll just make as much as we can and then put the rest back in the house. All right, go like that, and then build these bad boys too high. And see, this is where the beauty of Ender Pearls come in. I could use dirt to build my way up here, but I could just Ender Pearl my way in there like a pro. 
Alright, let's actually, we're going to use the rest of this, rest of this spruce wood to make spruce planks with it. And see, this is the beauty of getting six slabs per plank. Because now you get a crap ton of slabs, and I like it that way. I really think this house would look pretty good with, uh, what's it called? With, uh, oh, what is that? What kind of BS is that? Get that crap out of here. I just freaking wasted an ender pearl because of that. That's ridiculous. Uh, what I was going to say was I think this house would look good with birch wood. Because birch just, just looks fancy. But I did have a complaint. Someone's like, I think you used too much birch. But that right there, I think that looks cool. Someone said it looked a bit weird. Now when I see it from from this angle. Here, let me actually jump onto this slab. I just think it looks good. It's all built into the house just from this angle. I think it looks really cool. I like it a lot. And I hope you guys do too. Because cause I think it looks fancy. It looks good. Alright, so place it like that. Let's go onto this side. Line it up with these guys over here. There we go. Oh no, not like that. Dang it. Every time, every time. Slabs are just so... Ah, just so irritating at times. Alright, now I can actually step onto here. Actually, I need to kind of go along here. Actually, I just got a better idea. Do one side like this. Probably like, whoa, modest, what are you... What are you thinking, you crazy man? Don't worry. Don't worry. I got this. Got this like a pro. Place it like this. All good. Now, we can just go like this. See, at a lot quicker rate without falling into the hole. The only thing I don't like is this roof. Oh, Enderman, why are you on my roof? You're on my crops! I'm about to fight you, you jerk. But yeah, what I was going to say was the only thing I don't like about this roof is just the flatness of it. And why are these turning into oak? You guys see that? A little glitch, I place it and it's just like, nope, nope, I want to be an oak slab. An oak slab in a uh, in a spruce world. Alright, go like that. And then just fill these bad boys in. But yeah, if I just like add another one of these houses over here, I kind of have another house design I have in mind that I made in my creative world, but it's kind of iffy. It like... It, it involved using white wool, and I just I don't think it looked that good, so I'm going to try to redesign it before I actually bring it into this world, because anything I bring into this world has to look good. But there we go. We are done. We are finished with this house, except for the fact that... Oh, no, that's not going to bug me. Enderman, get off my roof. I'm going to take you down. Did that hit him? Did that technically hit him, or is he just... He's got those reflex... Oh, yeah, that hit him. You're going down, buddy. Ender pearl away! Ambush! Oh, jeez. Oh, is he attacking me? Oh. Looting! Looting! Dog, help me! Oh, the dog is afraid of creepers, but not the Enderman. No, dog! Dog, I don't want I don't want you to die! Yeah, the dog didn't even let me use the looting, but he lived. Come here, buddy. Come here, you're a true hero. Here, have a pork chop. Here, we're gonna heal- Oh, now you're in love, but that's okay. That's okay, you love me, right? Ah, oh, that's what I mean, though. The Ender pearls are so useful just to- just to kind of get around. I'm going to have to make sure I do a lot of this stuff off camera. Alright, bam. Oh, the only thing I didn't make was I didn't make doors. Silly me. I will put a pork chop there. I'll add a clock later. I'm not worried about that. Um, We can just put two torches there. That looks good. Oh, dog, you want to stay in this house? Here, here, yeah, sit on the bed. There you go. This is your house now. You, you earned it, buddy. I don't have any wood on me. Whoops. Oh, hello, chicken. How you doing? Are you, uh, you a friend of Kajuro's? I know he's gone. We miss him every single day. I, I mourn for that chicken. Alright, so place these bad boys up here. Shazam! Now let's actually light up this area, because when I was landscaping I had to remove all the torches. And see, that just looks cool. It's like, that is a granny house when I think about it. It's like, granny lives up on the hill. Leave granny alone. But that, that looks really cool, just kind of hanging out up there. Oh wait, I left a slab here. Slab, you're not supposed to be here. There we go. Now that looks good. Looks just simple and fancy and wonderful. Alright, I'm going to go sleep real quick. And then we are going to head to the uh, to the mob spawner and try to get 30 levels real quick. Because I got like 6 minutes left. I'll, I'll record a little longer if I'm almost to level 30. And we'll see if we can get an infinity. Even if not, see if we can get a... Uh, what are all the things? I think power, punch, flame, all that stuff. If I got like 3 enchantments on the bow, I'd be happy. I really would. Because I have strong feelings about... Uh, what's it called? About enchanting and how it should work. Uh, I'm actually, I'm going to grab a bunch of, or not a bunch, I only have two instant health potions. But I actually use these on the zombies because since the zombies, it's not a, uh, 
it's not a mob farm where they take fall damage on the way in so they're like a one hit so if you use an instant health potion on a zombie it like it reverses an instant health heals me but since the zombie's considered undead it damages it and then uh you know so i hit it with it and then it becomes pretty close to dying or at least i hope it does hopefully that's what it does uh that's what it does on the pc so i'm hoping it does that on here and where's this ravine this is why i need the rail thing because i, I can never find it there we go gotta be careful not to fall down here i remember my freaking journey to the ender dragon i freaking fell jump and oh geez hold on this creeper was gonna go airborne ranger on me but he seems to oh he must have already fallen once but i had the advantage on him that time all right uh pork chop do i have a sword in here i had like a chest entirely full of iron swords and i don't of course not um yeah let's get this out get our looting one out and blah, blah, blah. A lot of people were asking me to show them how to build one of these. I don't want to take credit for someone else's tutorial design, but if I find another another mob spawner at some point, I might do an episode just to kind of show you guys or showing me make it. It's pretty simple, so that's something. But I got to keep this covered because apparently, if the light shines in there, it affects the spawning. Hello, gents. Just just gather up. So yeah, pretty much I let these guys all gather up, and then, you know, once they're like crazy mad, because I remember once they were like merging through the wall, pretty much when they're like that, throw the instant health, it damages them, and then I just go to town with the sword. And uh, what I did before was I had this entirely filled with iron sword, so I don't have to waste mine, but I'm just going to use the looting one, because I don't really care to get a lot of flesh, because it's not really a bonus from that, but whatever, whatever, I'm not freaking out over that. Alright, uh, that seems good, they're going through. Splash potion. So you guys probably heard, they probably were all like, ah, you hit me. And now they're relatively weak, so they're dying pretty quick. There we go. Ah, uh, but see, I don't think zombies give you a lot of XP, so you don't really, you know, you don't do much. Oh, this sword has Smite 4 on it, and Smite's good against zombies. Awesome. So I get like a freaking crit on them every single time. Almost there. Almost level 27. You can get to level 30 probably, hopefully if they spawn more. I got a bunch of coal back in the house too, like a bunch of uh, of uh, silk touched coal, like the ore. So I could actually mine that and get some XP that way too. But, you know, oh well, if not, like if I don't have enough time to get it here, then I'll just do that next episode and that'll be a, a good way to kick off next episode. Come on guys, get all together. Get all together so I can, uh, you know, so I can splash potion you. But I do like uh, that I got all these ender pearls. Just go find a freaking desert or a plains biome and just sit there and wait. Just wait. Just freaking play a Game Boy, play on the computer, watch some TV. Well, obviously you need a separate TV because you gotta you gotta keep an, a sharp eye out on the you know on the Minecraft screen or on your Xbox screen. That way you can know if there's any ender pearls. And you just gotta kill them. Try to get a looting sword. Ba bam. And kill you, gents. Give me some XP here. Come on, guys, I believe in you. Oh, yeah, I'm already halfway to level 28. I think it is possible. Might record a little over 30 minutes, but, you know, oh, well. I wonder if I should start doing shorter episodes, because some people are like, hey, man, I don't have enough time to watch 30 ep or thirty minutes, so maybe I can, like, shorten it down to, like, every once in a while, I'll do, like, 20 minutes. 25 minutes? Whatever. I always freaking, I always wait till later on when I'm about to go to bed, and that's why I watch a bunch of people I subscribe to, just because I get bored. I'm like, you know what, before I go to sleep, I need to hear the voice of YouTubers. Is there a dog over there? Dog, what are you doing? Wait, ah, uh, come to me, XP. Come to me. Okay, well, one of them came to me. But yeah, this is actually a pretty, you know, a pretty effective, or effective thing that, you know, all you need is the, uh, the, uh, what's it called? You just need an instant health potion and then just whatever sword, and it works relatively easy. And instant health potions aren't hard to make, it's just nether ward, obviously, glistening melon, and then gunpowder? I have more than enough gunpowder. Well, actually, no, I only have like 30, 30 of it, 30 gunpowder, but, you know, I don't use it for TNT. Like, I have a few pieces, but I don't use TNT whatsoever, so it's not something that I worry about. All right, zombies, you're taking too long. I'm going to put this back, and then I am going to, I'm going to head back up there, and we're going to get that fort, or we're going to get our old fortune back, because we never used the fortune. We haven't gotten mine in forever, so we don't get to use it anymore. That was like one of my favorite picks. So we'll do that, we'll use it on the coal, and then we will uh, we'll see if we can get level 30 real quick. If not, we'll enchant from level 29. Come here, come here, let me kill you, I need XP. Yeah, oh, he gave me nothing, horrible animal. At least I got some gray wool from him. Wonderful, 
Wonderful. Yeah. Shut that there. Hello, chickens. How you doing? Do, 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 do. do I have a gray wool chest? I do. I do. I do. Plays it like that. Let's get the fortune out. And let's get the coal. Actually, I have a lot of coal. Jesus. Let's head on upstairs real quick. Let's give us some space so we can actually... Uh, what's it called? Actually mine these blocks. Oh, villager. You guys don't get in the way. Oh, this is bumming me up fairly quick, I think. Somewhat. Maybe. Maybe not. Jeez. Thought it was. God. Let's place a bunch of coal here. See, this is where people are like, oh my god. Creative mode. He's a hacker. Not really, guys. It's called a silk touch. Oh god. I forgot how good this pickaxe was. I just destroyed part of the ground. Oh well. Oh well. What are you going to do about it? I'm not going to freak out over it. Just keep placing these guys. Get to level 30 real quick. Oh, but we're at the 30 minute marker. Ah, ah joke's on me. That's going to take longer to render. Wonderful. Da -da -do. Dee -dee 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 -dee. Just get to level 30 real quick. Make a quick bow and check it out and see if we get anything good. Because I think that'll be nice. Da -da -do. Mind this. Ah, I love fortune though. I like getting... I love stuff that gives you a chance to get more. It's just, nah, it makes me happy. Jeez, I had a lot of freaking coal ore. I still have like two stacks back in the chest. It's ridiculous. What do you place all this? Almost there, halfway. I just deleted that block. Dang, I forgot how good this pickaxe is. You got freaking efficiency. A diamond pickaxe is ridiculous. Alright, go like that. And then get this good stuff here. Almost there. Almost. Come on. Come on. You can do it. I believe in you. Probably would have been better off staying at the mob farm. I thought this would be quicker. We there? No, of course not. We're freaking on the brink of it. There we go. Alright. Let's grab that. Place this back. Get this dirt here. Place that back. Wonderful. Alright. Let's go make a bow real quick. We better freaking have some string. I'm sure I got plenty of it. Oh yeah, I got plenty. I got over two stacks of it. Oh, what do you need? Do you need only two string, I do believe? I want to see you only need that much. Need three sticks? I hope that's right. I'm going to feel like an idiot if I needed three string. Which I probably did. No, of course I did. Of course, guys. Make fun of me. Feel free to. Freaking overthinking it when I could have simply just added one more string. But, you know, me, I don't want to carry one extra string in my inventory if I didn't need it. Alright, let's get that. Sweet, we got the bow now. Let's put it in here. And level 30, power 3, punch 1, infinity. Guys, we did it. We did it. Guys, oh my god. Oh, that's freaking awesome. I am so happy. That was worth it. That was worth the extra 3 minutes past my 30 minute mark. Oh, too bad it's not nighttime. We will have to test this bow next episode, guys. Like always, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please do leave it a like because it really does help me out. And, you know, I love you guys every time you leave me a like. Because every every time I get, like, 100 likes, I'm like, ah, 100 people liked me. But, yeah, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Leave a like, all that good stuff. All right, see ya.